Good evening. Thousands of you saw his mugshot on the air, and it has been the top story on Wayne.com for days. A man who had silver paint all over his face after he was busted for huffing. Well, tonight his wife is speaking out about her husband's addiction. News Channel 15's Don Austin talked to her tonight. It sounded like she had a lot to say. Well, that's right, Heather and Mark. Elizabeth Gibson wants people to know that huffing is just as serious as any other drug addiction. Her husband, Kelly Gibson, was arrested last week. Police went to their home because of a call about a domestic disturbance. Officers allegedly found him on his couch with a plastic bag, his face covered with silver paint. Out of nowhere, you know, he just gets this thought of, I'm going to huff. Kelly Gibson's mugshot is all over the internet. Some people may laugh when they see it. His wife Elizabeth says huffing paint is no laughing matter. He's a good guy, but when it comes to that huffing, it makes him a monster. When police responded to that domestic disturbance call, they found Kelly inside the apartment. He had a can of silver spray paint in his right hand, a plastic bag covered in paint in his left. Police say he looked dazed, unsteady on his feet. But people need to understand, he is still a person. He is a person fighting with a very ugly addiction. The prosecutor charged him with misdemeanor inhaling toxic vapors. It's the 48th time he's been charged with this since 1992. Elizabeth says those huffing episodes could drag on and on, sometimes lasting up to six hours. Afterwards, he's still like he's on it, but he's not. But then he'll calm down, clean himself up, and he's, he feels it's like he feels bad. Kelly is locked up at the Allen County Jail. Elizabeth says he won't get out until the end of May. But without help, that man's, he's just going to keep falling. Because he can't, he can't stop once, once it's in his thoughts. I've learned to accept some things, but that huffing I can't accept. And Elizabeth told me she plans to leave her husband. To learn more about huffing or inhaling abuse, look for the story at Wayne.com. Don Austin, News Channel 15.